Today on Big Brother, mysterious relationships and speculations are the order of the day. Kat also, she seems to be having a thing, I'm not sure what it is, with Chase. Ah, she's a bit two-faced, that one, you know, so... Mbali and Paris discuss Janae. Why <laughs> Oh, I see. Yeah. I don't mind being told, Janine, you're wrong, but the way you say it okay, how did will say affect it? me. You were just very aggressive about it. Is it? Yeah. Like as I if you were shouting you know. at me. I've now, I've slept, woken up, and said, yes, okay, what he, the words that were said, I don't disagree with them. So there's no, nothing the to tone. be angry. It's, the, it's <clears> just the tone. So I don't, why do I need to be angry? So when I let go of something, I'm not thinking about it anymore. It's gone. Mm. Do you know what I mean? There's so many things that we could all be upset about in each person if you hold on to it. Why mm. hold on to it? So, One so we could. So we could. So we could. Yeah, but I'm really glad. We're great. So, yeah. so, f- group hug, family yeah, hug. So, yeah. I think you're so emotional. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is just to refrain from it happening next time. Okay, I understand. No, no, no. Tell Big Brother what you feel your fellow housemates are basing their decision on for tomorrow. Well, we are all, if, if okay, if I'm given, say, two people instead of one, um, then we are all, obviously, grouping the obvious choice, that we are all basing a decision um, on who's the most, on, we would not want to bring the most interesting person yeah. Yes. I think I if I were them, I would pick someone here that I feel is likely to win the million to eliminate them from the game. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. To but make them go to because I don't think you can win the million from the chamber, can you? You never know. You, no. know. you, you don't know. know. You don't know. They no, even no, said no. Biggie even said only. Once they come in here, they have just as fair of chance of winning so the million like you, they like I you. So I guess already there they are potential millionaires. I think the concern, Piggy, is more of the process. Will there be one that goes and others stay? Or will it be a okay, chamber may chamber the chamber is closed down. So you all go and some will go to the to the house. Or is it one goes this week, another next week? And do we know if you're actually going to the house or you're leaving to go home? So we don't know what the process is. And that's kind of a... But I'm not thinking about that. I'm just thinking about me and how I can just get into the main house. You know, sure. They've seen us. Is it a problem? Problem right there, dude. Because, I mean, obviously they've seen us, though. Because, I mean, how the do they know me? How I think, I think, I think, I think, I um, think, would have actually handled this situation differently if we also had a slightly upper hand too. If maybe Big Brother at least gave us a way of listening to their conversation or hear how they speak or whatever, but or whatever it is, you know, maybe a visual without, without, without words. Then you're like, oh, okay, these are the, n-. but without them knowing that we also see them. You know what I'm saying? Like these guys too. Fine, we do know that these singers cause because they'll give really their food. So, so they're on their tip. But now, if now Big Brother had to just switch it up, because now they think that, okay, this man, go on top of it. Whatever we know, 
they you know fine they know that uh, 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 um, they watching us and whatever the case is but they don't know what we are about or they do no we don't know oh, what they are about we, oh yeah, yeah so they are in control <laughs> That's they it. do have an upper hand mm. Vanessa is offended by Manja. But what did I say to you on, on Monday? Wasn't I the first one who said, you look beautiful without makeup, but you took it otherwise? Because I, I ended up saying something else. No, you do look beautiful No, me. listen. But I, no, I, I, I heard a lot of things. I heard that people assume that I'm Tetsi when I got you. Then I heard I look like a mother with all the makeup <laughs> from there. Then I heard I who said you look stupid like a mother? until I started opening my mouth. Who said you look like a mother? Hey. I said you looked older. I didn't say you looked like a mother. You me, oh, me. Oh, Manda think. said yes, ah, that you told her I looked like a mother. But, you know, the thing is, <laughs> no, and then, no. And when, and when, but how does a mother look like? Then, have right? you seen when the she lost? Like 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 these things he bring said, you up. Yeah. You look like That's a mother. Beautiful. And the next day he told me, he so, thought okay. that I came here so and I was a what? No. I was a landlord. Allah. No, you could. Yes. I, I, can, I can see you as a landlord. I 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 see you as a landlord. And I hope I'm a nice landlord. You're going to pay my bond. <laughs> no, but all this is no. It was, I it was all on the same day. Uh, and and you but, said but, that. But you know what? You know what? You know what? No, I'm not denying anything. Eh? What I'm, what i the flaw that I've boom, just boom. realized, or I, I am still to work on. I don't know how to give compliments. Come on, Mr. See, no, I, I, I was just that? supposed to say you Vanessa? look good without Where's makeup and leave it there. Where's that? Housemates. <laughs> Tonight is your first task presentation. In preparation for this presentation, housemates must use the time left to complete their logos, slogans, and posters. Housemates must also complete their novelty item designs, as well as their brand promotional advertisements. For tonight's presentation, housemates will find an easel and table in the garden. One by one, housemates must present their brands using the table and easel to display the work they have been doing all week. The presentation will be completed once all housemates have presented their brands to Big Brother. Our work is a presentation of our capabilities. No right. Yeah. No right. right. A word is a presentation of our capabilities. No right. <laughs> it is. You all know what the buzz is all about. My brand and what I'm doing. But then you hear what he said. Right. There must be a novelty item, so there must be some kind of freebie. Exactly. exactly. That's promotion. There must be a freebie. Yeah. There must be a promotional ad. So <laughs> basically, when you're doing your ad, you, you could be saying, okay, this is the freebie. Maybe you can order this now and you get this. Or um, you get this once you sign up for the program or whatever. And tell Big Brother if you feel housemates are fully ready to win the 100% wager. The preparations, I feel that everybody's nearing um, the end of um, their the, the own preparations. Um I don't think that we're putting in as much effort right now because we've been locked up in, in one space for so much. It's very easy for us to get distracted. We have very short attention spans. And once we don't have anything to really debate about, everybody just kind of goes into their own little tangent. I've got my logo. I've got the. Uh, um, I've got my logo. I've got. Uh, I've got my um, my advertisement, but I, but I don't have my presentation, so I still need to do my presentation. So yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Your task for this week involves individual creativity. Chambermaids have to transform themselves into a board yes. game character, oh. a board game character. The character needs to be able to feature within an imaginary board game and each chambermaid should adequately be able to explain how their board game would work and ultimately how their character's special powers affect the game. Mm -hmm. In 
the storeroom. Chambermaids will find a box with outfits, props that must be utilized to transform chambermaids into their characters. For this evening's presentation, chambermaids must get into character and one at a time present how their board game would work featuring their character's special powers. Good luck. Big Brother. Did you I write this? In the board game, I am the main star as I am the star of my life. And my board game is music based, so it's very entertaining. So tell Big Brother what the relation between you and Lexi is currently. I think I think Lexi she's she's beautiful, first and foremost. She's She's entertaining. I'll always have you. I'll always check you. <laughs> For now, as a housemate, she is she is she she is she she will forgive me possibly one day, but I think she is yeah, she is gonna be a pawn <laughs> in my game, yeah. Today, twenty seven. <laughs> The fact that I said 27. Instead of 24-7. Chambermates discuss WeChat. Okay, guys, so we really thought about it. Give us some real thoughts, guys. The whole WeChat. If have given us some real thought. Like, okay, cool. So, like, but now, obvious, we feel offended. What, what, they combating us. What, 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 what. But maybe they don't understand who we are, you know? It's just the point of... Just they must hoping them understand. Like guys, please just understand. This is what's going on. This is who we are, and this is how we want. And this is what we want. This is who we are. Just allow us to reintroduce ourselves. <laughs> please understand that each individual in this house sees you as a competition. Therefore, will not audition to the competition. Right? Therefore, we'll not audition to the competition. If you want to know how to base your vote on Please how to free. bring someone to the house, mm -hmm. feel free to use whatever Biggie, whatever Biggie material, whatever material Biggie, Biggie gives you. you. Yeah. As from this house, we will not be auditioning to okay. our competition. Okay. And with that said, we would like to know whatever that we like to know, which is, for instance, do you have a microwave <laughs> that each we come in peace individual so there will be love let's go let's go guys understand that each individual in the chamber sees you as a uh, as a competition. Yeah, so yes. that now. Yeah, yes. that's what I wrote now. Guys, I understand that each individual in the chamber sees you as competition. Therefore, we will not be auditioning you to you. Please feel free to use any material yeah, that Big Brother bad. supplies you with to base your decision on. What they're basically saying is let's use the one on one video or whatever we're going to be having with them. That's what I understand. Yeah. That's, what, that's, what, that's, what I'm, that's what I understand. That's what I understand them to be saying. This is Big Brother. Are you doing the order now? Would all housemates please report to the garden? Your mm. task presentation begins now. Oh, guys. I decided to go with shoes because I feel like when I wear this, I feel on top of the world. I can do whatever I want, whether it's if I'm clubbing, if I'm feeling down, or if I'm going to go shop for five or seven pairs of shoes. And I feel like the fascinating part of it is that I choose to be different, I want to wear it differently, I want to wear it at whatever place I feel comfortable at. Let's give it up for J3%! You know, I'm a person full of adventure. I love things to live life on the edge. This rainbow presents color. I believe 
And this is why I went into this business. I've got a colorful personality. I love color. Oh, you can see there, Jeff. Right, yeah, yes, I can see, Jeff. <laughs> Thank you. Um, my name is Manda, and I am an African. African spelled A-F-R-E-A-K-A-N, meaning I want to accentuate the most important part of my brand. It's the freak in it, in that African. It's the freak. The freak is, the, the freak is for, F is for free-spirited, the R is for radical, the E is for entertaining, the A is for ambitious, the, the K is for the classic guy that I am. Wow. And, 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 and in my logo, you can just see it's me. I'm South African, I'm just a tall guy, sevens and sharps and all. I like partying. This is more of uh, my future, my future attributes, what I want to do in my future. I want to do computers. I want to study graphic design. Woman, I like big boobs, you know? <laughs> I'm very religious, you know what I mean? And this is also like what I want to still want to do in my future. It's like P, P, P. I can I say, I want to sky, not skydive, I want to parachute, you know? I do skydiving. I want to skydive, yeah. My t shirt here is what I am. Black on, the, um, black on the inside, white on the outside. I place the heart in the middle because I feel that even though people perceive me as mean or too honest, misunderstood, I do have a heart which is the red part. My logo is a heart with an R inside for real. Even though I'm real, I do have a heart. What you see isn't what you get with me. I feel like you get the innocent part of me, which is the cute, caring, lovable part that wants to be there and wants to care about everybody. I feel I'm very vintage, very classical, the way I think it's very old fashioned sometimes. And people might not like it, but it's the way I feel sometimes and it's just me. And then you also get the bad side, the dark side, the it is the it is in me, the God of War that just goes clan you sometimes. My brand is basically about me, about me being a luxurious person. I'm a person of I love to have a fabulous lifestyle. That's what I'm planning to aim for in the future and my goals. So people who want that's okay, that's why I had the puzzle. The puzzle fits in as to we all have our own little um, Areas in life where the past, we have the past and obviously with the present we have the future, right? So obviously all the puzzles or all the journeys that you take in life, you piece them all together. The main elements of my brand are depicted within the star. There's a Rubik's Cube because I believe my brand is multifaceted. You get different sides of me and every brand that is successful in the world has the ability to evolve and surprise the people that are loyally following it. So a Rubik's Cube does not remain the same color from any dimension. It does not look the same. Therefore, I feel I am diverse. As you can see, the, the chest, the treasure chest, okay? Usually a treasure chest has what's inside? Treasure. treasure. Okay, so I'm just going to let you into my life. I feel that my future is too bright. I do need shades, okay? And then as you can see here, the pearls, all right? The pearls represent the hardships that I've gone through. As you do know, it is a process for you to actually develop a, a pearl. It stays in the oyster's mouth. It starts as a grain of sand, but over time, through the pain and the hardships, it becomes something beautiful. My slogan is actually broken down within my name, simply outstanding lad, because that's who I am. Whatever I do should be outstanding. Each and everything in life that I want to do, whether it be music, or that be being on Big Brother, I gotta be outstanding. Now, I wasn't born outstanding. There's a small history lesson I'm gonna take you through, because I can't be who I am without acknowledging my history. Now, 1987, in a small shack, a boy like myself, was born and there's been a long journey of heartbreak and people dying on me but I prayed and I kept on religious and I love books I read a lot and I love food that's why I'm this size and all of that brought about this thing right here which is a violin because I'm passionate about music I've decided to package this in the form of a magazine right so this is the magazine my logo is myself right and the cover story holds my inspirations and things that I hope to achieve in life it's Behind clits, this is behind the clits. This is me unedited, right? So I was very ambitious. I want to one day be a five times five time Grammy Award nominee. Right? My fashion house, which is the legend. The legend is a fashion house. It's also a magazine. I'm the kind of person who inquires things, calculates things to verify them, measures their validity, reads to find out, and believe that over and above that. There is more information, so you can go to infinity and beyond with the information that you can get. I believe that money is a very important thing, and I've put it central because when you have money, you are able to do a whole lot of this as long as you do not make it be number one. Uh -huh. 
This is Big Brother. Housemates, good evening. Good evening, Big. Good evening, Big. Thank you for that presentation. This week, housemates decided to wager one hundred percent. Housemates had to be creative and produce an appealing slogan and advertisement that best represents their brand. Housemates, do you believe in your own brand? Yes, we do. Do you feel like you put in one hundred percent effort and one hundred percent passion into this week's task? Yes. Congratulations, housemates! You have won your wager. It's time for the chamber presentation. Hi, guys. My game is called Great Vengeance. Great Vengeance is a board game which has thirty-two blocks around the square. So my character is called. God of Shield. God of Shield has all the powers that you will find on the board. Okay. <laughs> the only thing needed in this game are a timer, any instrument, and these things which would be used as a dice. Okay. So how you play is it's called the magician, and one character is the magician. The game that I've created today is called the Chamber Ruler. The objective of this game is to capture the chamber that I have, that I am in control of at the moment. So in this game, there can be as many players from two players to as many as you want. The name of my game is the Music Master. Wash up, nigga, 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 nigga. The name of my board game is called. The hunting body. So there will be five detectives rolling a dice. If you want two, you have to have two clues of where the hunting body is. My game is called the dictator. So the dictator is a simple electronic board game where you roll a dice as you would for snakes and leather. So to qualify for the game. You need double sixes, and then you are in. So the dictator dictates the game, basically, and to get to the top, you have defeated the dictator. Thank you very much. Of course, you're not there. Are you tired? Who, who's that girl? That girl is shining. Who? Well done. Thank you, chambermates, for that presentation. Big Brother applauds you and congratulates you on yet another successful task. Congratulations! Cat is not happy with Saul. What? Casanova. I would give it to Saul because he thinks he is a Casanova. But why, Peter? You know what, no one really is a Casanova, so thinks he is, but because he's very flirtatious and like the thing is, he thinks That's why I stole the alcohol. He, he jumps around. No, I don't You've care. that. You've stuck with Lexi. I'm going to steal it the Jason. next time. Jason stuck with me. <laughs> so he's busy with me, um, Loco, with like Tando, and no one that like him. For me, particularly, I am more interested in Loco because I feel she's much of a stronger player. And much she's got she's got a, a backbone. Unlike Kat, I think Kat sometimes she 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 sways with the wind. I say I like him. Ooh. Yes, I can I can float back, but it's not like I'm gonna do anything with him. And the thing is, he's also he changes because the other time he's like I'm not I'm planning to have sex in the house. Ooh. Blah 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 blah. Jason. Then the other time I was like Ooh. I um. Jason. No, no. Soul. Then I'll the other time. <laughs> then the other time I told him I was like, listen, I was like, um, give me a back rub. And then he says to me, he's like, oh, okay, cool, but I don't just want to give you a back grab. Like, I need to go further than that. So then I was like, what do you mean further? He's like, you know what I mean? He's like, no, we must go up in the room and do our stuff quickly before everybody else finds out. Kat also, she seems to be having a thing, I'm not sure what it is, with Jace, you know. Um, but then again, it's only part of the game, Piggy. It's really just part of the game. <laughs> Uh, 
Whereas with Kat, ah, she's a bit two-faced, that one.